Yes. Seven minutes. I guess so. Seven minutes. Oh no. Uh, good job, Shannon. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Thank you, everyone. Oh, it was a minus good job. ten experience. I was on the fire. It was actually two minutes late, guys. Come on, give him, give him a break. <laughs> By your brother's book. <laughs> they said. <laughs> okay. All right. Welcome to Reign of Rust. Um. So, first off, I think you all know there's mostly new classes. There's a few less. Normally there are uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Normally there's nine classes. There's only seven in this series. And there's five players, so um, do say whatever. Um, but um, yeah, this this area uh, of the world is called Thanatos. It's a desert uh, place. Most of the inhabitants um, don't uh, don't have any contact with the um with the outside world um and those that those that make it out of the deserts generally never return so um banana mod. <laughs> no <laughs> <laughs> um the the region has uh, historically been ruled by the queen of red uh she is a uh, a sorceress queen um who's fairly um what's the word she's fairly like good to her people a good ruler um and does does her best you know uh but in the last um in the last six years there ha there has come in a uh um another magical overlord um he Firstly, he set up his desert town. For, at first, was a very good, uh, good and um, sort of good to people and stuff like that, and got a lot of people into his town. And then all of a sudden, he flipped, um, and uh, water. He, he outlawed water. Basically, uh, he he had the only supply of water, and every morning, everybody goes and lines up and gets their day's ration of water. Stockpiling water is illegal. Um, any kind of magic or magical items are illegal um, and uh, his his town and now his people are in the middle of the wastes um, with no other water sources for miles since he's destroyed them all um, to maintain his position and uh, uh, so as a, as a consequence with no water people can't get away. They can't cross the wastes because they'll die because there's no water. Um, they can't stockpile any any kind of water to try and make the trip because there's frequent um, uh, sort of they get soldiers to come into people's homes and throw everything around and find any stockpiles of water. So stuff like that. Um, uh, and uh, as a consequence, because there's no fresh clean water is almost non-existent. Infection is a massive killer. Um, uh, basically, if you if you get a nasty cut and it gets infected, that's nearly a death sentence because there's nothing they can do about it. Um, it is uh, rumoured by people in this town, um, which you guys will be starting in, that there is uh, across the wastes, the Queen of Red still is out there with her... Uh, with her kingdom of um, of the Red Guard, um, and uh, they found an oasis and have established a, a secondary city there. Um, although she's been pushed out, she now sort of has the role of sort of leader of the rebellion. Although they haven't really done much because the um, the wastes in between the two cities is uh, almost uncrossable. In the wastes is a uh, large perpetual storm that rolls around in circles in the, in the wastes continually rolling over the sands and um, it seems in the last few years it's been getting larger and pushing out further and um, um, destroying any semblance of uh, old buildings or 
it's just a giant desert and it's getting larger and it's creeping further and further um, into civilized uh, lands. So with that in mind, oh, I should also add, there is a, a group of uh, natives, uh, salamanders. They're um, sort of lizard people. Um, they're generally pretty solitary. They don't tend to group together into tribes or bands or anything like that. They tend to, once they're old enough to go out on their own, they generally stay on their own. And they are a collectible race. In... Shotgun. Okay. <laughs> All right, so here is your link, gentlemen. Right there in the, in the Discord chat. For character sheets. And we'll get that underway. Okay. So each of you should have your own uh, page. Mm -hmm. uh, and let me know what class you choose, because I've got to assign you your basic moves. Uh, fighter. I've already... Um... Named my guy to Xavier. Um, as always, guys, uh, can you when you change the name of your on your sheet? Can you also rename the actual tab? Done and done. Uh, names. <laughs> I've added your starting moves to one. Thank you. Yeah, can you explain um, sorcerer and emulator again? Uh, sorcerer oh. is a Sort of in terms of character creation, it's a more flexible version of wizard, except uh, it's like more specialist, really. So you choose a specialty, and that's what you do. Uh, but it doesn't have a spell list. You generate your spells and your magical effects on the fly. Um, Immolator is a pyromancer, basically. Everything burns. It's all about passion and uh, sacrifice to the to the great oh flame. Actually, okay. No. Okay. That's not working now as well. <laughs> Grunting noises. Great. Have you tried turning it off and on again? Sorry. Have you tried turning it off and <laughs> on again? I choose. Uh, I okay. Do I just pick three skills there, or? The, oh yeah, all three. Yep. For you. Because uh, I don't think fighter has any uh, differences. Fighter is pretty much the same as the standard fighter, just with a different um, uh, race selection. I didn't we'll see um, our classes already on that Facebook page. Yeah, some people yeah. have changed. So that was yeah, like okay. what, three weeks ago. I did that before I talked to, to you about it. So, Calvin Bodar, who's that? That is me. And what uh, class are you going? And whatever was on Facebook, and I don't remember what was. Seer, I think you said you were going to be. Is mm -hmm. the manipulator person? Iron Hunt yeah, is pretty right. much a range of kind of characters, isn't it? Uh, yeah, pretty much, Some except decks. specialized for the desert yeah. and the wastes. Is wisdom what they use for like yeah. perception stuff? Yeah. Okay. Yep. So, what were the races again? Red Guard. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, sorry, are these bloody Elder Scrolls races? Uh, Re uh, Red Guard is an Elder Scrolls race, yeah. and I've sort of taken a little bit, but it's not wholly and solely the Elder Scrolls race of Red Guard. Um, <laughs> the Red Guards are actually the, the people that are with the Queen of Red. Um, they're actual Aryan, which is just the general people of, of the region. You want me to treat him like a white folk? Are yeah. <laughs> supposed to have the same race short trait? Uh, no. They do. That's odd. At least on my... Uh, grunting noise. You said you were barbarian, didn't you? Yeah. I'm a fighter. There you go. I've added your moves. Your name is actually grunting noise. That's awesome. Well, it's pronounced. <laughs> <laughs> You should have a French I, accent. That'd be amazing. Like that throughout the entire thing. Well, no, that's just my name. My 
talk like a regular person. It's just, could... I mean, only my mother calls me. <laughs> Everyone else just calls me. <laughs> This is gonna be great. Is that yeah. the name you got because everyone was always just like grunting for you to go away? It's a family <laughs> name. <laughs> I reckon it'd be, it'd be great if just had a French accent and be like, uh, my name is. <laughs> and my mother calls me. <laughs> Actually, it's hyphenated. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh. No. Okay. I suppose I have to pick my traits. Yeah, Shari and Red God have the same um racial trait. Ah, I know why this was copied from an old version of a sheet of the sheet and and it has a problem with uh when the races are not in alphabetical order. Um, so, how many yeah. maps are we choosing? Cause I don't know which ones are default once we get generally. Uh, yeah. Hang on, I'll get there in a sec. Uh, uh, what the heck um, am I doing? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, I want to say. And false. Maybe it's not five, maybe it's four. There we go. Okay, the Ashari are uh, generally lighter skinned. Um, people that are, for the most part, under the rule of the Overlord. Uh, the Red Guard are much darker skinned, sort of think of African culture, um, who are. Um, part of um, the Queen of Red's domain whether or not you actually are from the city that they founded or not is is neither here nor there um, you can choose but for some reason you are in in the town um, that the Overlord uh, rules is only will um, trade attribute a need for sorcerer to intelligence or is there a secondary trait I should be investing in um, Scion where's my sorcerer mage that's based off int that's based off int that's based off int that's based off int pretty much Pretty much it. Okay. Um, Do we have any other charismatic people in the party? Um, I am, because I think uh, most of my, my abilities are wisdom. My aren't showing up. Oh wait, no, they're not. The, yes, they are. Um, for the strength stuff, like the modifiers. <sighs> Probably because. Okay. Oh, why are they not? You must have broken. It's your fault. <laughs> also, what does go. the precise tag mean on weapons? Ah, uh, it dex. means you use dex instead of strength for hack and slash. I don't want to do that. <laughs> I'll do that. I'll go Salamander. Yeah. Since I'm a sorcerer, that essentially means I'm um, illegal, aren't I? Yes. An outlaw. <laughs> You're an illegal. Okay. I am one whole illegal. Okay. Um, look at your alignment and racial things again because I am f fixing them because they were broken. Okay. So make, make sure that you double check that it has changed hasn't has or hasn't changed should it only have two races in my one? Oh, yours is broken what on earth have you done i haven't done anything i just as soon as you said check out your stuff i'm like okay so i cho choose my alignment uh let me let me That's try fine. and fix this let me try and fix it 
Oh, Squid, you changed my... No. Oh. My alignment thing. <laughs> yeah, oh, mine's broken too. Yeah, I'm working on it. Hang on. I liked it better on the other one. So the man is human like? Like humans or um beast they're beast? like bipedal and sentient, but they're like lizard people. Yeah. Sort of like um Dragonborn Argonians. in yeah, or Argonians, yeah. Or is that what the Salamander are, right? Alright, who haven't I given starting moves to yet? Um, uh, I chose my stuff, I know Jason, you. because he hasn't given a name yet. <laughs> so I can't do it to give a name? Nope, you got to give me a name first. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> what does your character Otherwise look you like, no Jason? Uh, he has a face. That was a good start. Bieber hair. Yeah, he has the <laughs> face. <laughs> Can confirm. Uh. uh, uh, uh what was it? Yeah. Doing? Sword is close, not reach, isn't it? Yeah, I still would be close. Hmm. Uh, Arid Hunter gets all of those starting moves. Awesome. Uh, so how many starting moves do we pick? All of them. Okay. Uh, or oh, Barbarian, you have to choose between uh, Armoured and... Uh... In part of the case, you can choose weapons. Oh, no. Maybe you don't, because yours version doesn't happen. What does a... what does the messy and forceful tag do? Uh, messy means that your weapon is particularly destructive, uh, like tears limbs and does things like that um, and forceful means that it pushes them whether it just pushes them back or t to the ground or I'll whatever take that one then. can you explain does the look mean anything like ancient unblemished or not stained or it would just be narrative response to your weapon Got a name for me yet, Jason? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe not. <sighs> Called the wilderness in between? The wastes. Wait. <sighs> it's cold. And what was the, um,. Big wind thing cooling in that the big desert storm. Yes, I did. Hello. 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 Oh. Oh, hi, Kazamas. Now I'll tell her to get this one the way boo is. Yeah, totally did. It's time to stop. Squid, what's the storm thing called? I took another way for you. <laughs> so rude. That is very don't... rude. I apologize for my rudeness. Because you don't have uh, a way. Neg 10 uh, XP. So, have a set, like, armor that we use, or...? Uh, 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 choose, what do you like, mean? heavy armor or something like uh, uh. Yes, I will go through... In a sec. So, is the setting of this kind of like Arabian? Yeah, yeah. Um, the the Red Guard are very much Middle African. Um, the Ashari are very much yeah Arabian, with a with a hint of Spanish maybe. Um, uh, and yeah, the the Salamanders like um. 
each one is because they're so independent they don't really have a culture so each one is fairly different distinct from the next it's gonna call the storm whatever okay fighter starting equipment i'm pulling it up now All right. Silvano, you start with your signature weapon. Make sure you note how much it weighs. Yes, huge uh, sword. Two weight. Okay. Uh, you have dungeon rations. Dungeon rations. Five uses, one weight. Yep. Choose between either chainmail and adventuring gear or scale armor what gives more armor uh chain mail is one armor one weight scale armor is two armor three weight Agree with that. okay scale armor two armor three weight <laughs> and then choose two of the following four options two health potions a shield um 22 coins, or, and the following is all together, an antitoxin, dungeon rations, and poultices and herbs. What does the shield give? Shield gives plus one armor and two weight. I'll take the 22 coins the shield. Okay. Where can I write on my campaign's notes? Uh, you can either write them in your personal notes, or you can write them in the note field underneath the, uh, the move. You said shield gave one armor, yes? Shield gave plus one armor, yes. So it's three armor. Mm. Okay, the Seer's starting equipment. So, Shannon? Yep. Uh, you start with dungeon rations, five uses, one weight. Um, bandages, three uses, zero weight, and they have a slow tag. Sorry, how many dungeon rations? Five uses. Yep. Uh, and that's one weight. And bandages, three uses, bandages. one weight. Three uses zero weight, and it has a slow tag. Okay. Um, choose your clothing, either leather armor or ornate clothing. Yeah, um, I'm guessing the leather armor gives me plus one, and the ornate gives me none. Yes, the ornate clothing has the expensive tag, and it is zero weight. The leather armor gives one armor and one weight. I'll go the clothing. Okay. So, animal companion thing has got a thing called guard. I'm guessing I mean the guard's the host. It's uh, a a tag that is stay here and guard this, or guard this person while I'm gone, or stand here and guard me while I do this, or whatever. Right. Okay, uh, choose okay. your weapon, Shannon. Uh, either a dagger or a sturdy divination instrument of your choice. What's the divination instrument do? Uh, it's got the close range and it's one weight. The dagger has the hand range and it's one weight. But like, what is the divination thing? Um, any tool of yours that you would use when you're like doing uh, some 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 magic div divining yeah the seer doesn't really do magic as such but it's like you know mental psychic stuff oh, it so doesn't really like matter so much catcher or something yeah or something yeah something like that um something something sturdy enough to hit someone with though okay yeah i'll go for that then Okay, so it's got the close range and uh, one weight. And you can define what it is later. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, choose one of the following. Either Halfling Pipe Leaf, Halfling Pipe Leaf and 12 coin, or Adventuring Gear and Herbs and Poultices. Uh, let's go with the pipe. Okay, so Pipe Leaf. And 12 coins. Three uses, zero weight, and 12 coins. Wait, so it's a Halfling Pipe. Uh, no, not, we won't go with Halfling because there are no Halflings around here. Pipe Leaf. And 12 coin. And there is a, there is a custom move of Pipe Leaf with somebody. You get like more honest stances around the parlay with them. Okay. Um, okay. Grunting Noise Barbarian Man. Yes. Ah, this is, okay, so it has fixed your thing. You have to choose either muscle bound or full plate and packing steel. Uh, okay. Pick one of those two things. So either you're going to be like Conan the Barbarian or you're going to be like full plate Barbarian. Yeah, I picked the name, I'm by the way. Cool. You picked the name? I did. Jafari? Okay. I've added your moves then. Okay. Okay, barbarian stuff. Barbarian, 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 barbarian. No, check on my again. I'm gonna be full plate. Um you just replace muscle bound instead of Uh, yeah. yeah, so uh, you should have muscle band as well. Muscle band as well as full plate. Um, yeah, yeah, because the option was between full plate and packing steel or unencumbered, unharmed. I'm sorry if I said otherwise. Okay, so you're starting gear. Um, you have dungeon rations, five uses, one weight. Uh, a dagger, which is one weight, and it has the close hand, uh, sorry, the hand uh, tag, not close hand. Um, and uh, a token of where you've traveled or where you're from. Uh, and then you'll make some, some choices. Uh, um, what are the tags on two-handed sword? Uh, close and plus one damage. Oh, and it's two, it's, it's, two it's two weight, by the way. Uh, and then choose one of the following: either or adventuring gear and dungeon rations, which I suppose would be more dungeon rations. All right, so chain mail is one arm or one weight. Yeah. Uh, make sure you tally up your armor, and you are done, sir. Cool. Okay, Yokri. Yo. You're starting gear. You start with dungeon rations. Five pieces, one weight. Uh, leather armor, one armor, one weight. Uh, a bundle of arrows, three armor, one weight. Uh, three ammo, sorry, not armor. I was going to say. <laughs> <I'm tired>. <laughs> <laughs> and adventuring gear, one weight, five uses. Uh, well, you also start with a hunter's bow, yeah. uh, one weight, and it has the near and far tags. Cool. 
choose your melee weapon, either a short sword or a spear. Any uh, for the spear? They have different range tags. The short sword is close, and the spear is reach. Mm, probably get a short sword. What's the difference between, like, what does reach do? Um, reach literally reaches further, but you have trouble in close quarters. If somebody's right up in your grill, you can't use the spear. Whereas a short sword doesn't have the same reach, but you can fight really close, if you know what I mean. And then, like, hand is like a dagger, which is in your hand, which is another thing. So if I decide to for... take the oh, was away for it again? Um, Sorry. close and reach um, range, I can fight, I can fight like really, well not really far away, but like mid-range yeah. to close? Yeah, as, as far as you could fight with a spear, yeah. Um, at, at, yeah, spear and a sword, so it's flexible. 